cruising through. They tie at the top of the league. Anything better than that. And he himself goes top. So the nine dart out. By Barneveld. A crisper nine dart as he'll ever see. He's up for this. Practicing in hours a day for the last two weeks. Such a lovely, fluent thrower, Barneveld. Unemotional. Taylor, the master at the upward and lower stack. But his first start sit isn't quite as powerful or as accurate as we've seen it in the past. Good point, good point. That's what he's saying to me after the Sunland exhibition. 106.5 plays 102.5. We said it would be a classic. Brilliant third dive by Barney. And Barneville going really at full gallop here to try and break Phil Taylor in the third leg. It's galvanizing. Said to the sportsman Pippin it there that he would have to have 107 upward average to handle Taylor. Guess what he's on now? 109.5. Barney delivering the bacon. Lovely second dot. 100. And again. Barnevelt has done it a finish and we know he can finish these tons. He did what five legs in succession in a recent uh, Premier League event. And Taylor wants this treble very, very badly. 100. Got well over 19, 18 ton plus finishes in this tournament. Still 60. a chance. Paul. 65. So 108 for Phil Taylor to win the leg and hold throw. He's having to really work hard here. Barnabas on the finish next throw. Treble 20. Double 14. Desperate dart for Taylor. And he's inside the wire. And a golden chance for Raymond Van Barnabas. To go ahead. That's the other ring. Chops he wants. Badly pulled. Two tens. Really can't afford to do that against Philip Taylor. Double seven, 14 going for Philip Taylor. Oh, good marker. Can bounce in off the barrel. It's an air shot. No, too hard. Got him a slap on the doubles. Body to go ahead. Bill ten. Good concentration. Good pausing. 14 inches high to double five he gets! Barney continues the form! The power looks slightly perturbed! But Taylor there looking rueful. He had three darts and a double to win that leg. And he knows against a player in the mood that Barnabell's in, he has got to produce his very, very best. In his match against Manley. A 3-3 three, three and a 9 daughter. He had a 78% checkout, Barney. That's the ominous figure here. So say if he wins this match. 8-6 or better. He's on top. 8-5. And he's clearly top. Predatory eyes. But nowhere predatory on the doubles or the stacking. This one should slide in off the barrel. 83. Still Barnabelt is inching ahead and he has the throw and making it really pay for him. 105. Leaving himself a finish 156. Taylor again must respond with a ton plus. He's 140 really Sid. Angle of opportunity to the right of the first marker. Went the most, the went the almost got the way, but was successful. Just the lad to do this. Oh, this would hurt. This would really hurt Taylor. I see one. The requirement Here we go then. Sixty, the starter. Trouble eighteen leaves double twelve. Decided to go the trouble twenty route to well. Here we go for Pierre Blue Water by the sea at Bournemouth. Barney the continuous winning. Where is he at? Once trouble seventeen. Eighty Eight tops. Tops he wants for three one against the power pool family. Well, they're both just showing some edginess on their doubles, but Phil Taylor will surely fill his boots here. Oh, double ten. 
Oh, one nine may seven on the doubles. Fives. Oh, the power! It's the last six shots of doubles and two legs. Gilded's chance for the flying Dutchman. Oh, the perfect lie is slithering off the barrel. Didn't need the slither. Barneyville, flamboyant and successful here in Bournemouth. Look at the go top of the league if he keeps it up. And Taylor has double trouble. Three darts in the third, three darts in the fourth to win the leg. He will not be a happy man. Well, Riddell, 14. Well, Barney's check out average 78% in that previous match against Manley. He is the more fluent of the two easily at the moment. Only one winner on his tail can dig deep. That's deep. That's not good use of the market, though, Dave. One hundred and one. Just get the feeling Phil Taylor just slightly rattled out of his cool. What's his finishing percentage, uh, Sid? Thirteen percent. That sells its own story. That's a fair assessment because he's had over ten darts of doubles. That's the perfect reaction. So is that. But if Barney gets a 4 1, I'm not sure Taylor's going to catch him. 37 years ago, signed on the line, joined the PDC. And everybody's winning for this match. Taylor looking great around the gills. Eyes pouching like the belly of a pregnant kangaroo. Well away. Hating it. Yes, the finish. Shanghai on twenties. Taylor comes back, but it was with the darts. He's still got to try and break Van Barneveld in this these six leg and Barney with the darts here. Slack last dart, if I was slack with it. Well the Patriotic here, 30 times world champion. Get massive tonsil wally from the crowd here. Hardest ticket in spawn at the moment. In Europe, Eight. the Premier League. Well, it's amazing to say that uh, Taylor's match average is over 100, but he certainly is not at his Six. majestic best. It's the measure of the man. Good break here, though, Sid. Taking the darts. Wow. Nobody wow. takes positive vibes from negative factors than Taylor he's the world's greatest is getting the act back on its wheels One slightly slacker attack on the 60 by Barney there Taylor still is nine in front and these might come out does so good cover shooting percentage shot from Taylor One terrific just terrific and though he did that exact shot in the 290 against Martin Himes at the New of the World, which was only three legs. Remember that? But he has Barney hot on his tail again. What a match! Just three in it in the scores, but critically, Philip Taylor has the darts. 187. Oh, wrong treble. Oh, he needed that one. Oof. How often you see Taylor getting out of jail with a plot into the treble 19. He has given himself a verbal, a verbal well he is Taylor. One hundred and forty. Brilliant! And this means that Taylor really knows he has to check this.